Hey, what's up guys? It's your girl Jazz, and I'm not super thrilled about this review. Um, these are supposed to be new out in the market, um, exclusive, I want to say to Circle K and Walmart. Um, I don't remember which one I found. I want to say Circle K, um, but anyways, uh, that's where I found these, and I'm nervous to try these. Especially lately, I've been having some heartburn, and so I have the hottest chip ever. I'm kind of uh, nervous to try these, should I say. And that's just putting it nicely. Um, in case you haven't seen, I've already done a couple other spicy foods, and let's just say um, my mouth and my stomach were not happy with me. But I did it for you guys, so you guys should feel loved. <laughs> I'm blaming you guys for me trying these things. I can't really say that because I probably would still search for these. When it comes to food, I would probably still search for them just to try them. Especially if they're new, exclusive, all that stuff. So, I'm going to go ahead and open these up. These are the Flamin' Hot Pepper Puff Cheetos. That just, that just doesn't... My, my stomach's already saying no. Stop. Don't do it. Yeah, and I ain't even got no milk over here. I think that's the part that makes me the most nervous. I have no milk. I have a drink over here, but it ain't milk. <laughs> so if you see me rush off camera abruptly, you know exactly what happened. I need some milk. <laughs> All right, so opening it up. Smell spicy. So it has a different smell than normal hot Cheetos that we're used to. It, it, it has that soft, but then it has that, like that, that I guess the ghost pepper would probably be the best way to describe it. Oh, um, yeah. Are these ghost peppers? No, these are just flaming Hot Peppers. Puffs. I don't know why I was thinking of ghost peppers, which is kind of what I'm afraid it might be, where it's, oh, these aren't nothing. I can eat about 10 of them, and then all of a sudden my mouth is on fire. But for starters, I only want to have it on one hand because I'm scared to have it on both. It comes in a little cheese, little puff that's shaped like a pepper, which I think is cute. Right now, I don't smell anything. Oh, it has a little heat to it, but it's not overwhelming. So we're just going to go ahead and bite into this and hope for the best. <coughs> yes, I'm being a big baby. Stop judging me, people. <laughs> Fine. I think I might have to have a chip off between the flaming Hot, the Triple X flaming Hot, and then these uh, flaming Puff Peppers. Now, I will say, I don't know if it's because these are bigger than just a normal, regular Cheeto, but it ha just biting off a of one, and I already feel right here burning up. It's not intolerable. But it's just that intense throbbing um, heat that, I, that I'm feeling right now. I, I can feel a little bit on my ears, so I know if I have like about two or three more, I'm going to need the milk. <clears throat> but it's, it's, it's not bad, especially if you're loving hot foods. I can easily see... My niece, who absolutely loves anything and everything spicy, just inhaling this entire bag. But the heat is similar to Flamin' Hot Cheetos, but it's just more intense. Um, to give you kind of the best mentality of how, how the heat, I guess, um, how would I phrase it? How, how much the heat, how intense the heat is. Now, it's not the jalapeno uh, 
heat. It's not the habanero heat. It's more of the flame and hot heat that we're used to with chips. But it has just a little bit more intensification, if that's a word, if that makes sense. If not, you haven't looked at the Jazzy Dictionary lately. Shame on you. Which is yet to be printed. <laughs> because it keeps getting words added to it daily. I like the fact it's not a normal, I guess, Cheeto shape. It's the puffs, which I don't really eat the puffs in general. And I've never had the Flamin' Hot Puffs. Because I do know that they exist out there. I just haven't had them. But I like it. It has a, it's a nice intense heat. So it kind of calms down a little bit. But then of course you eat another one and it kind of intensifies with each one. Because I can already feel even more heat than I did. I can feel it right back here. I feel that heat. But it's nice tolerable heat. We're just, it's just an added, added, uh, turned up, it's turned up just a notch or two. Probably three. But like I said, I've only eaten two chips so far. And I don't feel like I need to run to grab something to drink. But I'm pretty sure my mouth is pretty. Don't get close to me because you might burn. <laughs> I feel like you're dragging a little bit. I like these. But most of all, I like the shape. I think that's really cute. The little pepper shape. <clears throat> that one hit a little bit differently. <laughs> Alright guys, so that kind of wraps up this video. If you have any suggestions on new, weird, different foods that I should eat, please drop me down a comment below. If you've tried these, let me know what your opinions are. And just to say hi. I love reading your comments and responding back to you guys. Make sure that you subscribe to Jazzy Foods, as well as my other YouTube channel, Jazzy Reviews. Yeah, that's that one. <laughs> Just subscribe to Jazzy Foods and Jazzy Reviews. Problem solved. In the meantime, stay tuned and stay jazzy. Thanks for watching, guys.